Hey guys, it's Mark from Kazana, or Cos is Good. This is the Model 3, so I'm going to show you what you can do on the Model 3, okay? So, let's do this. Let's do the Smith Machine, okay? So you've got a bench, you've got a Smith Machine. You've got a Smith Machine, so you can do your shoulder press, you can do your shrugs, you can do chest press, incline chest, you can do your squats. Do your flat bench now, obviously. Do your flat bench. So, do your chest press, incline chest. If you have a decline bench, do your incline. Obviously. You do your squats, pretty much. Oh, now you can do, obviously, grab the bar, do the shrug, pretty much. It does have a safety swap, so if you want to use a safety swap, then pretty much, let's say you're doing shrugs, right? And you don't want to keep twisting your wrist, what you do is, have it like that, and you can just lift the bar up, pretty much. And so you don't have to keep locking your wrist out. Okay, that's the Smith machine. Also, I'll show you. Normally, with the Smith machine, you keep the weight evenly. But what you can do what you can do is you can have the weight off center. So we recommend you guys, when you use that Smith machine, have the weight evenly. But let's say you only have 1.5 or 110, you can have the weight off center. This is 20 kilos off weight. You can have it off weight. This is 20 kilos off weight. So the Smith machine, still run smoothly, okay? So, that's the Smith machine. Uh, it comes with your dips attachments. It comes with two J-hooks. So, uh, let me grab a bar. So, if you have an Olympic bar, you pretty much turn this into a squat rack. So, it turns into a squat rack. So, you can obviously get your squat, chest press, anything like a normal squat rack. You have your you have your safety arms here, you have your, your foot pad, or your knee locks, so you can do like your abs, all that pull down, and you have your landline attachment. So what I'm going to show you now is the built-in lat pull down and the plate loader function. Okay? Alright, so how you set up the lat pull down is obviously you have to move your bar out of the way. Go like this. We see attachments, it just pretty much lift up like that, pulls up like this. You want to drop this down, so drop this down to the bottom. Then lock it to place, or you can twist it to lock in place. You want to grab your cousin with a pull down bar. So we're going to do, you want to hook this up like so. You have a little hook here. Alright, like this. So now this is a lap pull down. So, what you can do, drop it a bit lower. So, you have your weight on it, you have your lap pull down. You can use a bench or a bucket. I like using a bucket on the pull. Come down like so. Lock your legs in. Okay. Just a normal flat pull down. Very simple and very easy to do. Okay. The issue of trying to do the lap pull down off the actual cables itself, one, sometimes the range of motion is too short, and two, depends on your body and how you are, the angle is too much or it doesn't really work. So that's why I designed this like this, so you get a fully uh, proper lap pull down, pretty much for free. Also, 
I will show you the lap pool, uh, the plank rod in there. Well, hello there. So, this is the plank loader. So the weight is semi kilos. So it's enough to do pretty much all your weight, like all your body parts. But when you're doing like a back row or a lap pull down where that's not enough weight. So what you do is, you can grab any amount of weight you want. You also you can have that plate loader off center. So, so normally you want to keep it even. So you, chuck, you can chuck, you can pretty much chuck one, let's try this, one, two, three, four. You can chuck on another 160 kilos on top of what you normally do pretty much. So you come back here, you grab the lap pull down. Deep in like that, and then down the weight is a lot heavier. Okay, so you get a lot more weight. Well, what it is is cheaper to do seven kilos and the plate load off. But what happens is if you do a hundred kilos, it's more expensive, but then you don't get that. Um, the plate loader on other models. So what happens is, if you're trying to do like a lap pull down, and you only have to put probably 120 kilo plate on the side. So that's only 120, it's not enough weight. So with a plate loader like this, you can add 160 kilos on top of the 70 kilos. So that's about, uh, what's that? Uh, 230 kilos for like a lap pull down. So it's a lot more efficient and better to do it like this than have the other way pretty much, okay? Also, you have a foot pad, so you can do your back rows. Um, you know, you got your arms, so you've got your cables. So, I'll show you the cables now. Bring this back up. I will unhook this. Hook this back up like that. Alright, bring it back up. I will take the weight back off. I don't need it. So the machine comes with cables. So a cable cross off the machine as well. So obviously you can do your, your chest press, you can do your, you know, your triceps, you can do, you know, any other exercises you want to do, bicep curls, anything you want to do. Also, we want you can do you can do your triceps when the lap pull down is so it becomes a like a overhead um, pull down pretty much. So you can do your triceps and other exercises like that, which you know, rope or anything. Also, it comes with a line landmine attachment. So, so the machine comes with two D grips. Come with your Black pull down bar comes with, with all the parts on the machine. These are my groups a lot. You know, deep attachments, the J forks, you know, safety arm, foot pad, everything. Uh, comes with semi kilos, plate loader, lap pull down. So it comes with everything we see on the machine. If you want the leg press attachment, that's extra. And if you want like plate waist, that's extra as well. Um, let's show you the lap the name line attachment. So you can buy this on eBay, it's pretty cheap. Yeah, you can do your back rows, pretty much like that. You can do your foot hover rows, like this. And obviously, if you want, you can do like your chest press, like this, okay? So guys, so pretty much that's the model three. I'll show you the lap pull down. I'll show you the plate loader and the other machines that I have. I'm playing with the lap pull down. So I have to show you everything pretty much. Exercise and wise, search on YouTube. There's plenty of videos on what you can do with a Smith machine, a squat rack, you know, cables, different exercises. So 
there's enough videos on that on YouTube, but it explains a bit more about the Smith machine. Okay guys, I mean, the more through. Catch you guys, see you in the next one. Alright, so, that's your landmine attachment right there. Got your safety arm. Got your dips. So you have your plate loader like this. Got your attachments there, the, the two D grips. So you see you got your plate loader like that. And you got a, a plate loader like that. So you can actually add plates on it on top. Got your foot pad there. Foot pad there. You got your lap pull down pretty much right there. You got your um, lap pull down bar. The bench is 300, so the bench is 300 if you need it. That's the Stairmaster right there. But yeah, it comes in black or red and black. So yeah. All the wheels are alloy wheels, so you can see it here. They're not, they're not plastic, they're all alloy, so they don't break down. That's the bar. Very easy to put together. There's a video on YouTube that explains how to put it together by me. It's all done. You know, your weight pins at the back, so you can put storage. You got your pull-up bar as well. So yeah, it comes with everything. It comes with everything. And it's very well made. Okay guys, so that's it for the uh, Model 3. Hopefully this helps. And I'll catch you guys on the next one.